final quarter of the under 16 division five red onion cap for Geelong junior footy and it's a very handy 18 point advantage but Lorpa with plenty of run in that that centre square bounce but in front taking a great mark Aaron Diaz who likes to bring the ball to the member side of the ground bit of indecision Luke, Luke uh, Paul Pemberton Peters waiting for the footy and allows his opponent to come in does well the young backward and uh, finds the van line member side here half forward flank lions into attack and he's three kicks in Good work there from Josh Beer, but again, standing up in front there was Evans. Taps the ball forward, Cannon now. Cool McCrice's handballs over the top. No one there to receive it, but he goes back in, Cannon. Shows some strength over the footy. Paddles it forward. Good work, but again, sharked by Scott. Sammy Scott now looks up the ground, good pass, and finds Warner. Warner now, plays on quickly, goes down to the road to Corridor, but there's no one home. Not a good kick, and a uh, timely grab there, David Boyle. Looks up for Lindsay Skipper now in the centre of the ground in uh, Nolan. <laughs> Picks the footy up and shows a ton of ash. Looks up the ground, the lead is sensational footy. And then Lee Lowry takes the footy. He's kicked uh, two here this morning. He's no more than 30 metres out, 45 degree angle. And East Geelong coming home with a bit of a breeze. And I suggest first score of the final term it will be enough drop punt I think you'll find he's missed two goals to his personal tally pushes the margin to 19 points ball now brought back into the member side of the ground by Leopold that was good play and fine Scott has a bounce then well covered great tackle there by Sammy Saldani has been good. East Geelong through, uh, that was, uh, I think you'll find the uh, Evans, the centreman, finds his teammate there in Collins who wastes no time. They're shooting the ball, good vision by both players and uh, an opportunity here. David Boyle, 30 metres out, pretty much directly in front. Comes in. Looks pretty good off the boot. No. Nope. Off Lawrence's his umpire. Another minor score. Leopold through the agency there of, I think you'll find it was the big bus, the uh, full back. Kicks to the outer side of the ground. Big chance for Diaz in front. Can't trap it, but oh, good work. Hand passes back. Looking there for his teammate who made position in Boyle. Kicks quickly up, but again, Benley Lowry over the back of the pack. Good smother from the Lions, because he had an opportunity there from 15 metres out. Lions showing a lot of uh, desire for that uh, loose ball in the, the last line of defence. Butt it all up, and we'll have another bounce down. About 10 metres from the East Geelong goal. Salope, the big ruckman, did well, but off cannon sharks the ball. The right way, right, right. you'll find he's popped the three. Great goal. Could be a match winning goal off the boot there of Kyle Cannon. Kicks his first. And a very handy eighth goal for the East Geelong side. Good work again from the big Ruckman Salo, but Evans' kick was well smothered. Sammy Scott now looks up the ground. The kick over the head of his teammate there in Donald. Good support though by Warner. But again numbers with the uh, East Geelong side. Great tackle. Kingsley tried to burst through but uh, was well collared. And Sammy Scott rewarded with the free kick. Plays on quickly. Could have been a push there. Havelberg. No free kick forthcoming. Evans. Good courage. Picks up but all the loose ball. Could he have been pushed? I think he was. And uh, Tommy Norton will get the free kick for the Lions. Thirty metres out, directly in front. Big chance for the Lions. Margin crept out to twenty-six points now in favour of East Geelong. Badly needed goal. 
to left foot kick. It's a floater. And I think you'll find it's floated straight through the middle. Great goal off the beat of Tommy Norton. That's his first for the afternoon. And a badly noted fifth goal for the Leopold Lions. 5-9-39 Leopold trailing East along 8-11-59 on the Red Onion Guest Media Productions final quarter scoreboard. Margin back to 20 points. Back to the centre. The medalist does well again. Just about unbeaten in those centre jewels. The big ruckman, Andrew Salove. Good work again. Kingsley impressed with his game. He got one in the snoz late in the third quarter, but he's back out there now fighting for his side. Chance now, Matty Elliott. He's been terrific up there at half forward. The bouncing ball, a little bit cool there for uh, the dash of Collins. Lions defend well. Could be a free kick out there, I think you'll find. And a chance now. I think you'll find it's Jake Marshall. Ball drops short. Scott in tries, tries to take the ball off the strong arms of Saldani, but Saldani too strong. And a lovely kick forward. Two finds his teammate in Ethan Lekas. Have a shot, young fella. He's what, 35 metres from goal. Hasn't bothered the scorers so far this afternoon has a shot up to the teeth of goal back of the pack oh nearly a nice mark taken by Tommy Collins couldn't do so and that's a, a rushed score the Lions now very congested half back line couple of leads forthcoming Alex to come to the count floating ball oh sees the big fella Norton does well the skipper Nolan I should say great unselfish play looks in board and finds Soldani, Soldani now, the drop punt. Nice looking kick, floats up there looking for Elliot, he can't trap it. Working hard now in defence was uh, Anthony for the Lions. There's been a whistle on play. And I think there's been a tackle rewarded. And it's going to go to the East Geelong side. Chips the ball short, looking for Elliot. He can't trap it, and uh, the free kick taken by Ethan Lekas. He's had a little bit of the ball with this last couple of minutes for the East Geelong side. Out of bounds, right forward pocket, 30 metres now from the East Geelong goal. Elliot again. Good work there, Beer. That was Josh. Quick kick out of defence, but it's all East Geelong. Hand pass over the top. Good work there, Duncan. Gave it back to Featherston. He gave it back to his teammate who's under all sorts of pressure. Cop on a little bit high and we'll get the free kick. The kick goes inboard. Nest of uh, Lions there coming onto the football. Norton. Only a short kick. Back of players of form. Chance now. Good work, Kingsley. Back to Saldani. Saldani to Peterson. Or Pemberton Peters. Kick well smothered. Elliot, they're still good enough to get a quick kick. Pays to be in front. Jacob Nolan, the skipper. Hasn't kicked a, a six pointer to Saldani, but he's got a chance here. 20 metres out directly in front. Nolan, the drop punt. Umpire does not move. Great goal. And the crowd cheer. The, the Eagles are just about home. And time check shows. Nine and a half minutes gone of the final quarter. Margin. 27 points. 9-12, 66. Leopold 5-9-39. Again, the big Ratman does a great job. Pumps the ball forward. Evans, good quick kick out of the centre, but a nice mark taken at half back. Plays on foolishly, but good enough to get a quick kick in was Burnett. Loose ball to half forward. See so Scott now, under pressure. Tries to do a little bit too much, and uh, is held with the footy. And uh, Lukey Hamilton Peters gets the free kick. To Kingsley, played for courage. Should have the mark 
high tackle doesn't matter great job there it's in a half back for mine good kick to and finds Elliot wastes no time looks up the ground ground level no oh, the skipper comes in quick shot at goal but he's offline Ball, ball back into play. It's a big fella, Andy Celeb, is he paid? I think he is. Nice mark now. Will the East Geelong side? Thirty-five metres from goal. The left footer just pokes it up in the air. It floats. I think you'll find it's floated through the big fella. Easy as you like. The medalist, Andrew Celeb. Kicks his first for the uh, the morning, and a very handy tenth goal for the East Geelong side. Five nine thirty nine, and uh, Mickey Bowman looking very pleased with himself. The coach of the East Geelong boys, team manager Matty Nolan, job well done, boys. As we see again, East Geelong clear the ball. Good hand pass out of the middle. Evans to Elliott. Elliott to the dash of Soldani. Can he kick his fourth? No, he can't. Well offline. Blots his copybook. He had kicked three straight, young Sammy Soldani. But uh, he's offline on this occasion. Lions now defending firm. Kicks out looking for Sammy Scott. He can't trap it. But I tell you what, Cannon can. He's been very good here this morning. Four consistent quarters of footy. The Rover Ruck Rover. But the Rocket Gibraltar for mine at centre half back. Sammy Kingsley. Done a great job for the Eagles. Evans, good work from the sentiment. Kicks it quickly up there. Lekas, let it go. Lions, plenty of numbers at the bottom of the pack. But no one can, can clear it. They finally do so. Looks up the ground. Finds his teammate there in Warner. He can't trap it. Good support there was from Norton. But again, Kingsley with sheer strength. Great work from the big fella. Looks in the centre of the ground and finds uh, Saldana. It's over his head. Elliot butters up. Tried to do a little bit too much on that occasion. All wrapped up and uh, is penalised. Good tackle from the Lions defence. Brings the ball out there looking for... And finally, his teammate in Norton plays on foolishly. Great tackle. And uh, Tyson Evans is rewarded with his efforts. Kicks up to the centre of the ground and it's a raffle. Matty Elliott at the back of the pack. Cool under in the crisis. Kicks it up looking for his teammate and finds him. And I think you'll find that's uh, Benny Lee Lowry with an opportunity to kick his third here this morning, no more than 25 metres out from goal on a very slight angle. The drop punt looks pretty good off the boot. He may have hooked it slightly. Right on the goal umpire. Straight through the middle. And great goal. For the East Geelong side, and uh, Ben Lee Lowry kicks his third, and a very handy 11th goal for the East Geelong side, who will be premiers in 2008 of the Red Onion Cup. Hope you enjoy the call on guest media productions. Paddy Smith on camera, Ronnie Brain bringing you a kick by kick description here this morning of the under 16 Division 5 grand final in 2008. Back to the centre. Andrew Saliva day again. Another enormous thump forward. Tyson this time beaten by Scott. He was bundled off it. Coming through Kingsley again. Tries to burst his way through as he's done all day. But well tackled on that occasion. And uh, sadly, one of those Geelong boys didn't uh, handle the boy, ball back. It's not against Kingsley, but he's on the mark and he's uh, good enough to take uh, his medicine. 
Chance now. Leopold. Too slow. High right, tackle to the umpire. Very lucky to get away with that is James Warner. Chance from 45. He's kicking to a bit of a breeze. It's a nice looking drop punt to the teeth of goal. Only a chance there for the big arms of Holloway. He can't take the footy. All we'll wrapped up at ground level, I think you'll find was uh, Dixon. And uh, umpire will come in and have a bounce. Now 20 metres now from the Leopold goal. Chance here for the Lions. Quick snap. Ball floats. I think it's floated far enough though for the youngster Jake Bakel. And a good grab there, Johnny Havelberg. Last line of defence for the East Geelong side. Goes to the outer side of the ground. The ball carries a good 50 metres. Lions again. Pick up. Bring the ball into the corridor. Sammy Smith couldn't take the ball. And has hurt his teammate there in back up. There's been a whistle on play. And I think you'll find the free kick to be taken by East Geelong's Dixon at the true centre back position. Goes out to the outer side of the ground. 17 minutes gone of the final quarter. Late in the, the final stanza. It's just about Zaron time, in fact, as we see working hard in defence. Genoa. Kick dropped short. Lions been a little bit uh, a little bit slow across half forty this afternoon. Drives now, drops it short, looking there for his teammate. Doherty, he can't take the footy, but East Geelong, clear the ball now to the member side of the ground. You've got Luke Campbell and Peters. He's had a great day. Carroll without the footy and will get the free kick. And fifty. Well, Pimbles and Peters, <laughs> not as fit as he'd like to be, he's cramping up. But there it is, like the finest, the final sound. No, no it's not. Only about 30 seconds to go. No, well, there it is, siren sounds. And it's all over here for season 2008, the Red Onion Cup of Geelong Junior Footy Under 16 Division 5. Premiers, East Geelong. Congratulations, Mickey Millman and Matty Nolan. Final scores, East Geelong 11-14. 80 have defeated Leopold, 5-9-39. Goal kickers, first of all, Brimley Lowy with three. Sammy Saldani with three. Uh, singles to Kyle Cannon. Luke Diaz, Jacob Nolan, Matthew Elliott and uh, Andrew Salave. BAG for nine. I'm going to stick with the uh, very the big arms of the number 13 Guernsey, Sammy Kingsley. Apologies to the 32 Guernsey, Kyle Cannon, and the medalist Andrew Salave, who were very good for the East Geelong side. Likewise, Matty Elliott. But for four consistent quarters of dashing, strong defensive footy, congratulations, Sammy Kingsley, the guest media productions player of the grand final in season 2008. And uh, on behalf of Ronnie Brain of guest media, Paddy Smith on camera. Hope you've enjoyed. Have a fine guest media production.